Hey everyone, it's cookout season, and this means lots of grilling burgers. What goes great with a burger? Some amazing homemade mayonnaise. Let's make some today. To get started, you will need one large egg at room temperature. To mix up the mayonnaise, you're going to want to use a blender, a food processor, or an immersion blender. And today we're going to use the immersion blender to mix up our mayonnaise. You're also going to need one cup of a neutral oil. We're using canola today. You also need one tablespoon of Dijon mustard, one tablespoon of white or red wine vinegar, a quarter teaspoon of sea salt, and this is optional, but you can add in one teaspoon of fresh lemon juice. After you have gathered your ingredients, you're going to want to blend your egg for about 20 seconds. You really want to break up that yolk and kind of start the process. Next, you're going to add in your Dijon mustard, your white or red wine vinegar, your sea salt, and the optional lemon juice, and give it a little stir. Now is the fun part. You're going to very slowly drizzle in your oil, making sure to really combine after every addition of oil. This is creating an emulsion, and this is what makes your mayonnaise so light and creamy. Remember to take your time and trust the process. Like magic before your eyes, your egg mixture will transform into a light and creamy mayonnaise. Oh, this looks so good. Want to give your mayonnaise some extra flavor? Chop up two cloves of garlic, one tablespoon of fresh chives, and one tablespoon of fresh parsley. This is so great, especially when it's garden season and you have all those fresh herbs. Blend your chopped herbs and garlic in with your freshly made mayonnaise. You now have a garlic and herb mayonnaise, which is so good on sandwiches and can even be used as a dip. Store your homemade mayonnaise in the fridge for about a week. Although it's so good, it probably won't last that long. Hopefully, we've given you some inspiration to make your own mayonnaise for your next cookout. You and your guests will not be disappointed. As always, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click that bell so you're the first to know every time a new video has been released. Thank you so much for watching.